Hey guys, welcome back to How to Repair guys. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel guys. In today's video guys, we're going to cover what you need to do guys when you are ready to install your cylinder head gasket. How to prepare your cylinder head, how to clean your cylinder uh, block guys, the engine block, the cylinder head and all that guys will explain what needs to be done. Because some people will just remove it, replace the gasket and they'll try to put it together. It doesn't work that way guys. Everything needs to be super clean, smooth. Otherwise you can develop a gasket leak. Your car can overheat or mix coolant and oil guys. So you have to be extremely guys careful how you prepare your cylinder head and your engine block for the new gasket. So that's what we'll be doing today guys. As you know, we have more than 200 videos on every car we get at the shop. Our mission is to save you guys as much money as we can. So please subscribe to the channel and like the video guys. We do all our work again guys just to save you money. So let's start on it now guys. This is the cylinder head I want to show you before and after and what we need to do. Okay that's what it is right here guys. This is the cylinder head. That's what it should look like when we are ready to install it. That's what it is when we remove the gasket and we remove the head. So same thing will need to be applied to the engine box. So what do we guys do? Okay all the tools and parts guys that we use you can find the links in the description of the video below. You guys need to get a scraper. The one with the long handle, super handy guys. I really like it. Now, mistakes that people will do. Never ever go forward with the scraper guys. Always hold it about 45 degree angle. Okay, and you're going to pull back. Okay, check it out now. You're going to pull back, okay, like that. That way you cannot cut through the head guys. Because that aluminum is soft and otherwise you can damage it. Okay, I want to show you how much gunk we got out of it so far. About 45 degree angle guys, you need to hold it, otherwise you can scratch things. Okay, here we have a little bit of paint from the gasket, our gasket, okay. Perfect, that came out. Silicone, if you have silicone, cut that as well guys, prepare everything. Silicone you can, okay. You can see it's still holding here a little bit. Okay, perfect. Now, brake cleaner or parts cleaner, guys. Okay, and we're going to spray inside the pistons, uh, the, the cambers too. Okay. The combustion chamber, excuse me. We're going to get a soft sanding ball, guys. This is it right here. We'll have the link in the description of the video below. And you start sanding back and forth, back and forth and it's going to clean your head. Now it needs to be fine bulk, fine sanding bulk, not really coarse because otherwise you can damage your head. So in the meantime you can spray just a little bit more brake cleaner. You have to make sure guys okay that everything dries before you start putting it together. Leave it for a few hours everything evaporates really quick you need to blow guys with air, hold the canals as well to make sure that you don't have any gunk inside anything in the coolant passages, coolant and oil passages, that way you can guys plug it up. Perfect. Now we're going to wipe it and check out guys how much better that thing looks. If you want to clean your uh, combustion chamber, what you need to do guys, spray brake cleaner, leave it upside down, okay, for a little bit and uh, everything everything will come out super easy. Now we have just a few more spots here and there to touch up and that cylinder head guys is practically ready to go. Inspect your canals, okay make sure you don't have anything otherwise get a compressed air with air compressor blow through them to make sure everything comes out. Same thing will need to be applied to the engine block. Okay engine block you just pretty much clean it guys the same way that we clean the uh, cylinder head and uh, all we have to do get a new gasket now and you will be ready to go once you do all that guys so hopefully the video will be helpful thank you guys for watching please subscribe to the channel for more videos and see you guys next time